I'm going to walk through a quick tutorial on how to create a desktop recording on a tablet computer. In this case, this is the Windows 8 Surface Pro, and what I'm going to do is just capture, I'm just going to capture a desktop recording, video recording of what I'm doing on this, uh, on this computer, and then capture that, post it to, um, and create a video, post it to YouTube. Okay, so first of all, I'm just going to start up Windows 8. Um, in the uh, on the Surface tablet, and then uh, start up the Camtasia Relay. Uh, this is the desktop recording software that I'm using. You can use other software as well. It's just a simple interface with a record button. So I'm going to click record here, and uh, it's going to do a countdown and then be live. Uh, so recording my desktop now, and uh, then what I'm going to do is go over to uh, I'm going to go over to OneNote, uh, for example. Open this up. Uh, you know I can record some lecture notes. I'll switch over to my pen now. Um, so write um, some, some notes here, markup. Uh, you can import Word documents, Excel, uh, PowerPoint, um, and, and write directly on those. And then once I'm done, I close this out, and then I come back over to my Camtasia Relay and click Stop. It's going to finalize the recording, and then I can review it. Um, okay, so there's, uh, there's my recording and it's just going to go through and show me what I had just recorded. Um, I can uh, do some simple trimming um, just to add some uh, trimming uh, breakpoints there on the left or right. Um, actually, let me uh, delete that. Okay, so there's just my full video. And then once I'm done, um, once I'm done with this, I click Submit. Okay, and then I can give it a title. Um, you know, this would be a, a profile. I can uh, post it to YouTube directly. Um, let me go ahead and just do YouTube, and then you can give it a title, and then click OK. One of the reasons why I like to create these videos are to shift more of the learning outside of class, so that in class we can do more active learning exercises, and then also if there's a particularly difficult concept, uh, the students can re-review that uh, multiple times. Um, the other thing that I found is uh, for these videos is um, you know keep, keeping them to about five to ten minutes seems to work really well. Uh, you know keeping them focused on a single concept during that one video and then post, post multiple of those uh, if I need to cover multiple concepts. That wraps up this video tutorial on how to create videos from desktop recording on a tablet computer like the Windows Surface.